Can you add sound to a replica lightsaber from Master Replicas? And in this case, I'm talking about the model lightsabers, not the FX lightsabers. So just the scale model display pieces, you know, that you would put on your shelf. Those are the ones I'm talking about. And the short answer is no. <laughs> so first of all, these are all master replicas. I only have the 0.45 scale master replicas right now. I don't have any full size ones yet. This is a Corbinth, and I did want to have this in the video to show you that this is an example of a hilt that is designed for a sound install. So you can see, you can, well, you can just see inside here that it's hollow so that you can wire this, you can customize this very well. This is a Corbin OWK hilt. Master Replicas, on the other hand, I'll put that <coughs> over here. Master Replicas, even though these are the small ones, the large, the full-size hilt models are exactly the same in that they're solid. So that's very hard to work with if you want to install some wiring, if you want to install sound. You'd have to figure out a way to hollow it out first. And I've heard about some people attempting this, but this seems very treacherous to go that route, especially considering the fact that the full-size master replicas right now, oh, a lot of them are at least $500 or more a piece. And so that would make me kind of nervous if I'm trying to mess with, with a saber that way, you know, hollowing it out myself. It's a little intense, you know. You probably are better off just going with one of the other Sabre companies, you know, get something like this Corbinth OWK, for example. There are quite a few empty hilts on the market that are specifically intended to accommodate an install. So anyway, that's probably the route you want to go, but yeah, if you're feeling really brave and adventurous, you could try hollowing out a solid lightsaber, but... It's really not that advisable. <laughs> anyway, that's it for now.